This is an inflatable space station being developed by Lockheed Martin, and this is what it looks like after it failed after almost six months of being pressurized to four times its designed loads. This was a long duration creep test where they anticipated that the higher than normal load would eventually lead to localized stress and ultimately failure of the structure. It lasted 4,177 hours, and if you think about it, they had to have that high-speed camera running all of that time so they could capture this one glorious moment. Inflatable structures make a lot of sense when your rockets only have limited space inside their payload fairings. But equally, there are a lot of skeptics who see them as risky. Originally, this module was being developed to be part of the Starlab space station, but since then it's been replaced by a rigid module to be developed by Airbus. Meanwhile, Sierra Space are also developing their own version, the Large Inflatable Flexible Environment, or LIFE module.